In the welterweight division at UFC Fight Night, you got Gabriel Bonfim taking on Nicholas Dalby. Now, this thing is in Sao Paulo, Brazil. Bonfim, Brazilian. He's coming in at 15 and 0. Dalby, a worthy opponent, though. He's 22 and 4. Bonfim, two inches taller at 6 1. Dalby's 38. Bonfim, just 26. So, one guy leaving his left his prime. One guy in Bonfim getting ready to enter his prime. So, it makes for an interesting fight. Bonfim, over six significant strikes per minute. Uh, Dalby right at four, so a slight advantage there, or well, really a nice advantage. It's like 30 significant strikes different uh, difference over the course of the fight for Bonfim. He also lands uh, about a takedown and a half per round, so over the course of the fight, you're looking at four takedowns potentially, where Dalby just gets one in the course of the fight. Now, Bonfim, 100% takedown defense. That's that's very helpful. Undefeated in the UFC, right? He's 15-0 and overall, has won all three by submission over Trevin Giles, Munir Lizez, so he's doing his thing. But again, Dalby's pretty good, 62% takedown defense, that could be a problem. He did beat Muslim Salikov by decision, won a split decision over Warley Alves, and beat Claudio Silva by decision in his last three, so he's rolling a little bit. And Dalby is really good, but Bomfim is just better. It's in Brazil, he's Brazilian, it's going to be a big night for the Brazilians, even in this one, I think Bomfim wins. He's faster on the feet, better on the ground. And with the really good Brazilian fighters, you see that all day, every day. And it's hard to go against them, especially at home. Bomfim wins, uh, in my opinion here, welterweight division, UFC fight night.